things, but it was in there. You can see right there. Okay, we have Sandon here today. How old are you, Sandon? Eight. He's only eight, but he's a soccer player and he's a pretty active guy. He serves and he got an ingrown nail. You can see over here in the corner, he's had it for about three weeks now. It's right around this area, it's been infected. So I already numbed it. Now we put a little tourniquet on it. So now I'm gonna go here to get it freed up. You feel any of this, Sandon? No. No? Okay. So I go, let's see how deep it is in there. It's got all the callus built up around it already. So we're gonna go in there and then free up the top, free up the bottom, like that. Okay, do you feel any of this? No. Okay. So I'm gonna cut the nail through. So as you can see, young people get ingrown toenails too. So he's really brave. He's not feeling anything. So he did really well with the injection as well. He's all around tough guy. Well, he's a surfer, so this is nothing. For him. So there's a nail right there. It was not a big piece, but it was in there. You can see right there, right there. And then I'm just gonna make sure nothing's in there anymore. Just clean up a little bit more there. We don't have to take this, what we call a granuloma. This is an inflamed tissue. Well, we could take some of it out, but it's not necessary. A lot of time when he starts soaking tomorrow morning, all this is going to go away by next week. So we're going to take a little bit of the tissues out, but we don't have to do a whole lot. Just We're just cleaning the dirt. So allowing this area to drain, so it's going to be clean by the time I see him next week. So I'm just making sure nothing's in there anymore. So as you can see, it's all done now. So now I take this tourniquet off and then I have some antibiotic cream with a little bandaging there. Wrap it up and that's really all there is to it. I bandaged quite a bit. This could be pretty bloody. So I put more bandaging there just for today so that um, he won't be bleeding all over the place wherever he goes. Going back to school today? Yeah. Okay. So you have to have some good story when you have the big bandage like this, okay? Okay. Maybe some kind of a surf story, maybe? Oh, you had a 10-foot wave, yeah, fighting the shark, and then shark bit your uh, big toe, and then it was bleeding, so you found me, and then you came rushing over to see me. Something like that. What do you, what do you think of that story? Um, uh -huh. yep. I don't know. You, you may have a better story. You, you, you come up with a better story, okay? Yeah. So that, that would have been my story, but that doesn't have to be your story. So this is what it looks like. He wears a sandal today. So and then he's going to start soaking tomorrow, twice a day, to make sure there's no infection there. And then that's, that's what it does.